What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overload here. We're going to be talking about Welcome to Dairy in this video here today. So just when everybody thought that this wasn't going to happen, Bill Skarsgård's return as Pennywise in the Welcome to Dairy Max prequel show to Andy Muschietti's It Chapter 1 and It Chapter 2 has been confirmed. He will be back as Pennywise. We know that show is supposed to be digging into Pennywise's origins. It's supposed to be set like 20 years, I think 30 years or so, prior to the events of what transpired in the events of It and It Chapter 2 from 2017 and 2019. So knowing that Bill will be back is amazing. And I will throw this out there just to, again, remind people of where this first started making the rounds. Jeff Snyder had previously a while ago at this point, almost a year, over a year at this point, stated that Bill would be back. Uh, I, I don't actually believe that he stated that he had signed a deal or something. He could have stated that. It's been a while since I watched that clip, but I remember Jeff was one of the first people I had heard with a reputation for, for being correct, stating that Bill would be back. And now here we are with the confirmation. It took us a while to get here, but shout out to Jeff Snyder for that report, which ended up being correct once again. So this Report is coming from Deadline. It says here an exclusive, a familiar face is coming back to terrorize the children of Derry, Maine. Bill Skarsgård is set to star in and executive produce the Max Eat It prequel series, Welcome to Derry. Welcome to Derry is the working title. That's what Deadline has here. Welcome to Derry is just the working title. Strange. But it says here he'll be reprising his his title role as It Pennywise from the hit 2017 New Line movie It and its sequel It Chapter 2. On the Warner Brothers television produced series, Skarsgård is reuniting with other key auspices from the it film franchise the two movie director andy muschietti producer barbara muschietti and chapter two co-producer jason fuchs who developed together the tv adaptation of the stephen king horror classic as well as the film's other producers roy lee and dan lynn andy muschietti will direct four episodes of the nine episode series so this series will have nine episodes did we know how many episodes this was going to have in the past i don't really recall knowing how many episodes this is going to have but i'm looking forward to this show We've gotten a glimpse of it because we know it's supposed to air in Max sometime in 2025. All we really saw was an overhead shot of the Losers Club. And I think we saw some glimpses of activities from a tree branch, but nothing really too over the top as far as like first look footage has has been concerned. There are some footages online of a kid being jumped. Looks like it's local bullies, kids, teens picking on another kid. That's just some footage I've seen online. The main priority here, of course, and we now have confirmation that Bill Skarsgård will be back as Pennywise, which is something that a lot of people were clamoring for. I cannot wait to see Bill Skarsgård return as Pennywise. I'm certain he will knock it out of the park just like he did in those first two movies. And I know that some people, of course, prefer Tim Curry. I will say that even beyond who I prefer, I would say Bill actually does manage to make Pennywise somewhat more un unnerving with his facial expressions and his mannerisms even if i were to let's say prefer curry's look i think when it comes down to who makes the character more menacing i would have to give that to Skarsgård. his facial expressions and his tone of voice and how there's obviously some unease behind it all because we know he has evil intent with these children he's interacting with but then to hear him speak to them in some of these very lighthearted ways and then it turns into a sinister tone the way he does that has made the character way more menacing than what i recall seeing from tim curry it's been a while since i've watched that tv adaptation that came out in the 90s i'll probably revisit that soon but i cannot wait to see what he cooks up in this role when he returns to Dairy Maine in this prequel show. What do you guys think will transpire when it comes down to all things Pennywise? What do you think we're going to find out about Pennywise? Uh, do you think the show will be good? Do you think it won't be good? Are you excited for Bill Skarsgård to be back? Do you really not care? I got a question also. If it wasn't going to be Bill Skarsgård, who would you have liked to see replace Bill Skarsgård as Pennywise? Let me know all that down below. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications so that you never miss a video. In the description, I'll have links to all of my social media accounts. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course. Let me know if there's any movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.